What's up guys, it's Umar Farouk here from Try On Lee. I am back for the second part of this, of this series, of the NBA's Greatest Player series. And I'm here with my top 5 shooting guards of all time. So uh, before I get to my top 5, I did have like trouble figuring out who was going to be number 5 and number 6. And the guy that I have at number 6 I think should be mentioned and I think will eventually get into the top 5 is D Dwayne Wade. He's He's been an amazing player, NBA champion now three times, he's won the finals MVP. And even though he's trending down like you know in his career with the injuries and stuff, he's still a great, great player and I think he deserves to be mentioned in it, someday in the top five shooting guards of all time. Maybe not just yet. Now moving on to my to my top five. My top my my fifth best shooting guard of all time is the Iceman George Gervin. This guy was silky smooth, great scorer, just and really, really brought the San Antonio Spurs to relevance in the NBA before, I mean, they, they were just an expansion team in the ABA actually, and here comes George Gervin flying through the air, laying up that finger roll that, he, you know, he kind of trademarked that move. He was a nine-time All-Star in the NBA and also a three-time All-Star in the ABA. He a uh, four-time scoring champion and he was really good at scoring. I mean, he averaged 25 points for his career. Five-time first uh, All-NBA team and he's one of the 50 greatest players of all time. He never got to really, he never got to win a championship, but man, he was a great, great talent, great, great scorer. My number four shooting guard of all time is Clyde the Glide Drexler. And he he was just, he was kind of like Michael Jordan's uh, rival, you could say. You know, when you thought, when like when you talk about Jordan, you know, in his playing days, the guy who was right under him was Clyde Drexler. He won an NBA championship with the Rockets, although he played most of his career with the Portland Trail Blazers. 10-time NBA All-Star, NBA All-First Team once, but you know, he, he, got, he got on the All-NBA teams, and, you know, I think four more, five more times. You know, both his number is retired both in Portland and in Houston, which says a lot about you. One of the 50 greatest players of all time was on the Dream Team. He averaged 20 points, six rebounds, and six assists a game. So that 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 really proves that you're a great player, a Hall of Fame player, and really he could slam. He could dump that ball really, really good. That's why he's called Clyde the Glide, just gliding through the air. I mean, you. Should probably go check out his highlights. Pretty sick stuff. The three, my number three best shooting guard of all time, is Jerry West. Now some people say that oh he's a point guard, and I I kind of categorize him as a shooting guard. He played both positions, and it wouldn't really matter because if I did characterize him as a point guard, he'll still be my three, my top three point guard. So really, he's three in both situations. But he is the logo of the NBA, alright? The picture that you see on the lo of the NBA logo, that is Jerry West. NBA champion. NBA finals MVP on a team on like when he lost. Yeah, like that's pretty remarkable. Four time fourteen times he was in the all-star game. I mean he's been a scoring champion, he was a great defensive player also. You know, he's Top 50 greatest of all time, obviously. 27 points a game, 6 rebounds a game, and 7 assists a game throughout his career. I mean, he was just one of the great players of the early NBA, and I mean, just a great, great player. Led that Lakers team to so many title appearances. They never really won too much because they always had to face the Celtics, but man, they. They, that was a he was a really really good player. Just a knockdown shooter, knockdown shooter. Now my number two shooting guard of all time is another Laker great, and that's Kobe Bryant. Kobe Bryant, the Black Mamba. And I mean, what, what can you say? This guy has really really worked hard throughout his career. Came in as a high school, came in right out of high school. Five time NBA champion, two time final and finals MVP. Surprised that he only has one MVP. But 15-time NBA All-Star, he won the MVP in the All-Star game four different times. He's been scoring champion. He's been on All-NBA teams, 
all defense. He's been a nine NBA all defensive first teams. That's I mean that's pretty crazy. He's the Lakers all-time leading scorer, and I think he's currently fifth on the all-time scoring list. You know he's he um, hall. I mean he will be a Hall of Famer eventually. He's averaged 25 points throughout his career, and he also has five assists a game, about five rebounds a game. He's won gold medals. I, I think he's just a very, very, very great player, and I hope he comes back from his injury and plays strong. But obviously, number one, and I don't think it's in, I don't think anyone needs to discuss this. He's the goat, the greatest player of all time. It's MJ, six-time NBA champion, six-times Finals MVP, five-time MVP of the season, four time, fourteen times in the All-Star game. Uh, the, he's he was even a Defensive Player once. Just an incredible, incredible player. It's, competitive spirit that drove him was just amazing. He averaged 30 points a game, he, he averaged 6 rebounds a game, and 5 assists. That's pretty remarkable. And he, on the dream team, and obviously if he's the best, he's on the 50 greatest players list of all time. Just an incredible, incredible person. He was great for the NBA, just in terms of his play, his style, the way he conducted himself. And I think I think he was just a, I mean he's such a big sports icon. Everyone knows who Michael Jordan is. You type in Jordan in Google and you get his name and his shoe brand before you get the actual country Jordan. Just an amazing, amazing player. And I think everyone should respect him. And I think everyone knows that he is the best player of all time. So those are my top five shooting guards of all time. Next up is going to be the top five small forwards. Please. You know, feel free to comment, you know, give me your top five in each position as I'm going through this. And uh, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. And until next time, so long.